so cute. Yeah. And you just squeeze it to open it up. But does this not look like Bottega? This is something that you'll probably see in like Aritzia or Zara. I just couldn't resist. I couldn't resist, girl. Hey girl, we went to Target. No, like we really went to Target. I haven't done a Target haul in a minute. Y'all know I'm always in Target, but I haven't done like a, you know, just a full blown dedicated Target haul. So I got a lot of good stuff. Y'all Target is coming up through with the spring stuff, like all the things. I don't even like spring, but they have some cute pieces, cute little, you know, sets, workout sets, pants, all of that. So. I got a few things that we're about to talk about. And I think I'm just gonna pick up each bag and go through it. I'm not gonna, you know, go in any order. But yo, okay. So the first thing I wanna talk about that I grabbed that I saw on the shelf. Well, it wasn't on the shelf, it was like on the hanger. It was this bag right here. I was kind of confused at first cause I thought the bag was just kind of like twisted. Like it just wasn't, you know, hanging on the, on the rack like it was supposed to. But I realized this is how it's supposed to be made. This is the Future Collective um, bag by Gabriella Karifa Johnson. And you guys know they have their all the Black History Month stuff at Target right now. So I just thought this was different. It's so unique and different. Like look how it's made. So there's a zipper right there in the front. And I didn't know if it was supposed to be right here or if it was supposed to kind of flip like this. And I don't know, but I thought it was different. It's cute. And I mean, you can't go wrong with the black bag. Black goes with literally everything. But I honestly think once I put everything in it, like once I start filling the bag up, the shape will form. Um, Cause right now it just looks, I don't know. It's just very unique and different and cute, but I love it. And then look at the inside. It's like a lime green. So cute. Very, very cute. And I like how it has a zipper and it has another pocket on the other side. So, I mean, it's really cute. Cute little spring black bag. And yeah, so I got that. I also grabbed, ooh, I got some self-care products, y'all. Ooh, okay, wait. I kind of want to just do all the self-care things in one and then yeah let's do that let's do all the self-care products last because this is like the most exciting part i be excited y'all so i'm gonna put all the self-care products in one bag so yeah girl let's stick to the accessories first and then we will do my clothing pieces and then the self-care products last so i came across some earrings y'all y'all have to like really look like i feel like like with target it's kind of a hit and miss with their jewelry. And I saw this pair of earrings. It's the, um, it's by the brand A New Day. Look how pretty these are. So I got a pair of pants to go with these. I cannot wait to show y'all what they look like, but look how pretty these are, you guys. They had other colors. I saw this lime green. So freaking pretty, y'all. It's so cute. And they had a white pair that I almost got to, but I feel like if I got the white, I probably would have messed them up because you know when my earrings kind of touch the side of my face right here if i have makeup on it's gonna mess them up i think i'll probably mess these up too but i couldn't resist this color like this is a really pretty lime green like it's like a neonish lime green really really pretty um so yeah got those and i also got okay this was definitely a necessity but when i saw it i was like wait a minute this is cute this is like really cute this is a, um, it's a sunglass case, eyewear case, and you just squeeze it to open it up. But does this not look like Bottega? How pretty is this? So freaking cute. But yeah, I definitely need this because I feel like I'll be throwing around, like I'll be throwing my sunglasses everywhere. And I have this one pair of sunglasses that I wear more than any of my other ones. And um, I just need a case for it. So I went ahead and got this and this was like $8. Yeah, $8. Super cute. They have other colors. They have a black one. The black one isn't made like this though. So like the stitching on this, I mean, it just looks like Bottega. <laughs> but the black is just like a plain black um, leather. I mean, it's not real leather, but it's just, it doesn't have, the stitching isn't like this. They have a pink one, but they didn't have it in store. I see that the pink one is online. Um, but 
Honestly, I like this one. Y'all know pink is my favorite color, but I like this. It's very different. And it was super, super, super affordable. So got that. And then, okay, the last thing I have is not accessory related, but it's makeup related, y'all. So I saw this girl on TikTok. She did a, um, she was trying out this concealer. And as soon as she put it on the face, I was like, let me go ahead and hunt this concealer down. It's the new concealer from Thread. And this is a black owned brand. This is the Thread... Um, Thread Beauty Cover It Multi-Use Complexion Fluid. So I don't even know if this color is going to work, but she used this shade and I feel like she and I um, use the same color in um, complexion products. So this is in the shade Deep Tan. So we're gonna try it out. And this has a really nice um, size applicator. It's like a really thick, big applicator, but I am gonna be trying this out. Let's talk about the clothing pieces that I got. So y'all, I was really, really, really surprised at all the pieces that I found in Target. Like usually I go in there, I can't really find much. That's why I usually just shop online um, whenever I see like cute pieces on other people. So I went in there not even looking for this stuff and it just like hit me in my face. So the first thing I got was a set. I feel like a lot of, the, a lot of these are sets. Um, this, as if I need any more of these, y'all. I know you don't have to tell me. You do not have to tell me, but I love wearing sets around the house. And I saw this really pretty purple short set. So it has the drawstring in the front, cute little shorts, and then the matching top to go with it. Really pretty. So I sized up in the top because I like my tops to fit, you know, kind of oversized. And then the shorts, I just got my true size, which is a um, small. Yeah, so small in the shorts and then a medium or a large, what is it? Yeah, a medium in the um, sweatshirt. So a cute little set to wear around the house and I can wear it outside of the house. So if I want to go run errands, this is cute to wear, especially in the springtime, just put on some slides. I wore this bodysuit, um, well, I took a picture of it and I put it on my Instagram and I wanted this color first and they didn't have it. They were sold out and they restocked and now they have it. So this is a, just a, like a full regular degular bodysuit. Here are the straps or jumpsuit, whatever you want to call it. And I got the blue one. It's really pretty too. It's like really pretty on my complexion. I'll try to remember to put this uh, picture on the screen or if you follow me on Instagram, you probably already saw it. Um, but yeah, I wanted this one at first cause I love this color. Like this is a, it, uh, it's in between a pink and a purple. It's not like a true, true purple, but it's also not like a true, true pink, but it's real cute. And I feel like with bodysuits, you can do whatever with them. Like either if you want to go to, you know, work out in them or just, um, put on like a cute little cover up to go on top of them or whatever. They're really cute. So, hey, stop. No. I also ran across this from the brand Colsey and it's the cutest one piece, y'all. I don't even know what I'm going to wear with it. I really do not know how I'm going to style it, but it was just so cute and it's something that I don't really see in Target. So look how pretty, very, very stretchy. This is something that you'll probably see in like Aritzia or Zara, but look at the color y'all. I don't know what it is, but I'm loving this color on my complexion y'all. This blue is so pretty, but yeah, it's just a regular one piece, short tank little situation. Um, and I don't even know, like, is it pajamas or is it just something that I can wear out? Side. I don't know, but I'm definitely gonna wear it outside. Like I'm not just gonna wear it in the house because it's so cute. Put like a white, maybe like a white button down over it and have it open. I'm excited, so cute. I mean, I can't. They have a um, black one, they have a tan. They just didn't have my color. Y'all know I would've got the tan, um, but they were just out of my, not my color. They didn't have my size. Um, and they have, yeah, that was it, the black this color and the tan. Next is this short set that I got. So it's just the white linen shorts. It has a pocket on the back. And then the top to go with it. And this is from the brand Universal, um, hold on. okay. 
um, universal thread. And this is a cropped top. So it's a crop button down top. Linen material, the perfect material to wear in the spring. So, and that's why I got this to wear it um, once it starts getting, you know, warmer outside. So I got that. I also got another one just like it, but I had to order it because I didn't have my size in store. Um, it's the blue and white stripe which I mean, I'm gonna have it in the description if you guys wanna check it out, but it's exactly like that white one that I showed, but it's just the um, blue and white stripes. Um, and then I got another one. <laughs> I got another one, y'all. I know I just be getting carried away with sets, but I feel like with sets, they're just so easy to put on. Like you don't have to think about it. Just throw on a shoe, whatever type of shoe you want with it, you know, and go. It's not something I have to like really just sit and think, hmm, what am I gonna wear today? You know, I can just, you know, pick out a set and be good. So yeah, anyway, I got the pink one. Y'all know I had to get the pink. Like this pink right here is very bright. This is like a highlighter pink, but it was so cute. And this one was the last, like the last one in my size. Well, the shirt um, was the last one in my size. So I went ahead and snagged it. This is the shorts. I mean, it looks just like the white shorts that I just showed you with the one pocket on the back and then the top. So this isn't a crop one. It's just like a regular button down pink um, top, but this is an over, it says relax. Yeah, relax fit. And I had to get the extra small in this because it literally fits like oversized. So yeah, super cute, you know, throw it on in the spring and summertime. I usually don't try stuff on in the store but something told me to try these pants on and when i tell you they hug in the right places and suck you in in the right places y'all okay first off look at the color look at the color y'all such a pretty tangerine orange oh my gosh y'all i cannot wait to wear these i already know what i'm wearing with them i have um one of the tops in the bag but very very look at look at the waist like look at that it's gonna it's gonna just mm. so i got a size four um and these are high-waisted which is what i prefer when it comes down to wearing pants um and they just fit so 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 good y'all like so good it's like the right amount of stretch the length is perfect i'm five two so i'm pretty short um and they're just perfect so yeah now it comes with a little tie around the waist. Very, very cute. And this is what the bottoms look like. It's not like super duper flare, but it's like the perfect boot cut pant. That's so nice. And it's like, it doesn't fit throughout the leg. It's just like fitted in the waist and the butt. And then it kind of uh, flares out in the leg. So it's just, they're just so freaking cute, y'all. I cannot wait to style these. And then the top that I got with it, y'all, I kind of got carried away because these are like really, really good. So I got a lot of basic tanks. <laughs> and these are so, so, so soft, y'all. Like when I say butter smooth, buttery, silky, soft, and stretchy. So this is one of them. The brand is by A New Day. And they're just basic tanks. But they fit so, so, so good. Really nice, really cute, very, very stretchy. And I got a size small in these. Um, I got that color, I got the white, cause you know, you gotta have white in your wardrobe. I should have got like two of each. So there's the white and then this tan color. And then I got a black. Yeah, I definitely should have got two whites and two blacks because I like wearing these with literally everything. I got that. And then I saw some more tanks that, you know, I just wanted to get, which are these right here. Nice, basic, stretchy tanks. Like when I say this material, <laughs> literally feels like something you would get from Skims or Aritzia. It's so freaking nice, y'all. And this is ribbed. The other one that I showed you was not. It's like, you know, this material has that ribbed material. Hopefully you guys can see that. Um, really, it just, just go to Target and fill them and you'll know exactly 
what I'm trying to say. They just feel so, so good. And then this color right here. I like this color, y'all. I really like it. It's like a mustardy, orangey, coppery color. It's so pretty. But yeah, those are the tanks. So with the, um, the orange pair of pants, I am just gonna be wearing this tank with it and have it tucked in. Cause I like, you know, white to go with any splash of color. So I think this will look really pretty. And then the earrings that I showed you, I think it's gonna look so cute. It's gonna look so cute. Now let's get into this, the self-care bag. Y'all look at, look <laughs> at how much stuff, like this is heavy. I have so much stuff in here, y'all. Okay, first thing, oh, I just got me a little Listerine mouthwash that's like boring. So y'all, I have been seeing this body butter all over social media. It's like a new, I guess it's a new one, I don't know. It's a new one from Tree Hut. It's the vanilla whipped body butter. And when I say, I snatched it off the shelf so fast and threw it in the buggy because like, it's not often that I find like the new stuff in my Target. So I went ahead and got this and I haven't even smelled it yet, so let's see. Literally smells like warm vanilla sugar from Bath and Body Works, like back in the day day. Cause I feel like that scent kind of changed. But back in the day, like when you were in high school, well, when I was in high school, it had more of a sugary scent. And now I feel like it's more of like a, it's not as sugary or as sweet as it used to be. At least to me, it's not. But this literally smells like the OG warm vanilla sugar. Oh, from Bath and Body Works, it smells so freaking good. I think they had um, a body scrub, but I just wanted to get the body butter because I needed, well, I didn't need a body butter, but I wanted to get another body butter to put in my, you know, my little self-care collection. And y'all, 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 while I was looking at the body butter, I saw that they have new body washes. Tree Hut has new body wash. I mean, maybe I'm just late, but this is the Moroccan Rose, which is my absolute favorite scent from Tree Hut. Um, the Moroccan Rose fo Foaming Gel Wash, y'all. I was almost tempted to get the other ones, like just to get all of them, but I was like, Andrea, calm down. Get what you know. Get the scent that you know. And I love this scent. I absolutely love this scent. So went ahead and threw that in the buggy as well. And I also needed to get another one of these Eco Tools um, exfoliating washcloth. So I got that. I got, oh, I got some new stuff. Well, it's new to me. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe y'all can let me know. But this is the Urban um, Hydration Renew and Restore Vanilla Sugar Scrub. I've never tried anything from this brand. I mean, it looked new. They had everything on the shelf. It literally looked like they just stocked the entire shelf. Like nobody touched the shelf. I feel like I was the first one to touch anything on the shelf. So let me know if you tried anything from um, this brand. I'm very excited to give it a try. Let's give it a little sniff and see what it smells like. Ooh. Ooh, it smells like a, ooh, it smells like a pina colada. I don't really smell like the, the vanilla. It smells more coconutty to me and tropical and kind of like a little pineapple in it. Maybe, maybe it's just my nose, but it doesn't smell like vanilla. It smells good though. It smells really good, but it doesn't give like that vanilla sugar vibe. Maybe it's just me. Um, oh, while we're on the topic of that brand, I went ahead and got something else. This is the um, Renew and Restore Vanilla Everything Oil. So it says body breakout clearing on it. So I don't know if this is actually gonna work, um, but it's supposed to, I guess, clear out breakouts. And I usually get breakouts on my back from like, you know, hair products and stuff. So I don't know, girl, let me know. <laughs> Y'all let me know if you tried anything from this brand. Um, okay, what else did I get? Oh, y'all, okay. I kind of went crazy on body wash. I was just gonna get this and be done. But when I say, I got very, very excited when I saw that the shelf was full of the native body wash, y'all. Every time I go in my Target, the shelf is just, it's cleared out. So I was very excited to see that literally everything was on the shelf. I went into Target on the best day. <laughs> 
I feel like they had just put literally everything on the shelf before I got there. But this is the Eucalyptus Mint. Oh my gosh. It kind of smells like the one from Necessaire. But it's more minty. Definitely more minty. I don't even think mint is in the Necessaire body wash. I think it's just all eucalyptus, but uh, smells so good. So got that. I also wanted to try out the cucumber mint, which smells incredible, you guys. It smells so freaking good. And this is a good body wash anyway. I used to always use the vanilla one. So I wanted to kind of give um, some other ones a try. And then this one, this is the Cashmere Rain. Y'all, when I say, oh my gosh, y'all. I really wish y'all can just smell literally everything on the screen so y'all can know what I'm talking about. But this smells so fresh and clean and just oh, all the good things. So yeah, those are the only three, well, the four body washes that I got. I really didn't need all these body washes, but I just couldn't resist. I couldn't resist, girl. I also needed another deodorant. I saw that Saltaire was in Target. This is the um, Seascape Skin skincare deodorant. So I already used the, um, the vanilla coconut one. It's the one in the pink container. But I wanted to give this one a try. I smelled it in Target and it's very fresh. And I wanted something like this, like something really uh, just clean and fresh and that's exactly what this is these are actually refillable um i didn't see any of the refills maybe i just overlooked it but you just twist it and it comes out so you can refill these if you want to you know just purchase the refills i'm sure that they have them on their website but i didn't see them in target but yeah this is very very clean and fresh and just like straight out of the shower fresh type of scent so definitely wanted to get another one of those but in a different scent um and then i got okay so I don't know how I'm gonna like this because um, I've been seeing mixed reviews. This is the new Elf Cosmetics Woe Glow Sunscreen. So I posted this on TikTok while I was in there and then like literally almost all the comments under the video was telling me I should get it. So um, I went ahead and got it and I don't know, like I said, I've seen like mixed reviews. I've seen some people say that it gives them a white cast. I've seen them say it breaks them out, I don't know, but I mean, I feel like it's worth a try, you know? It's worth a try. Um, and then I got me some more of the Good Wipes, Good Down, um, Good Wipes, Down There Wipes. These are flushable, love these. And I also use their um, um, Feminine Wash that you guys know I absolutely love. Okay, so Mix Bar has a new scent. Oh wait, I gotta go up there and get the other one that I got, cause it's in my, closet but um mix bar has a new scent called pear blossom i was gonna get the perfume but i was like let me just get the body spray like the the mist first to see if i like it and this is very um it's very clean it's like i didn't expect it to be this clean smelling like fresh i guess i was expecting it to be more sweet but it smells really good it smells like you just got out of the shower like it doesn't smell like your typical sweet pear scent i don't know it's just very it's like a subtle pear scent but you smell more of the floral but it's not too florally <laughs> y'all Okay, this is the channel you don't come to when you wanna hear about fragrances. <laughs> I'm just playing, <laughs> I am just playing, but I am like not the best at describing scents. And I'm just being honest, but it's a very um, fresh, straight out of the shower, pear slash for florally scent. Um, it's really nice though, it's really, really nice. Really soft and girly and flirty. I like it. I'm not even gonna get up. This is just how lazy I am. But the other scent, um, the fragrance that I have, I'm just gonna put a little overlay right here, is um, one of the new fragrances from Finery. So I smelled all of them in Target when they you know, finally put them out on the floor. And honestly, the ones that I smelled smell very similar to the ones that I already have, like the higher end fragrances. And they're supposed to be like dupes to the, you know, the high end fragrances. So. I was like, I'm not gonna get something that I already have. Let me get something that I don't have. So I went ahead and got this one and um, this is very fresh. It's another like 
fragrance that I'll probably wear in the springtime. Very girly and feminine and fresh and sweet. Um, and I don't really have that many fragrances in my collection like that smell like that. So that's exactly why I got this one instead of, you know, the other ones that I already have in my collection. Um, and then the other thing that I got, well, the last thing I got was this Loops um, Double Take Glow Mask. So I've seen a few people using this on TikTok. I feel like I get a lot of like things from TikTok, <laughs> but I've seen them use it and this is supposed to just, you know, make your face look more glowy and just you know all the things it's just a cute little pink mask that I'll put in my self-care routine so I went ahead and got that and that is it girl that is everything that I got from Target I feel like this is probably one of my biggest Target hauls honestly and truly I think it is but yeah girl that is all that I got from Target I hope you guys enjoyed thank you so much for hanging out with me while I shared every single thing that I picked up let me know if you tried anything that I shared do you like the product do you not like the product let's talk about it down below in the comments but yeah girl that is it thank you again for hanging out with me if you enjoyed today's video give me a huge thumbs up make sure you are subscribed if you're not subscribed already and I will see you guys in my next one